Hi everyone. So it's been a little while since I've done one of these Trespasser videos. I thought I'd take a second before we get back into the playthrough to talk about one of the game's more unique technical achievements. So we've talked about the outdoor environments, the physics-based game engine that was coded from scratch, the uh, inverse kinematics-led animation system. We've uh, noticed the hand just a little bit in our playthrough, but one thing we haven't talked about too much is this uh, really cool real-time audio foley system. So how does it work? Well, items in the environment that you can interact with, like this keycard, for example, are given a material value. The keycard is plastic in this case. By throwing or rubbing or smacking that uh, material against another material in the environment, it'll generate unique sound effects on the fly by combining the two. Trust me, this is actually really cool. Now, the system wasn't perfect. Uh, the immersion factor really relied on the number of materials that it could use at any given time, and a postmortem for Gamma Sutra programmer Richard Wyckoff actually talked about the relatively low number of material combinations that you could make in the game, but you could still get some really unique sound effects. For example, rubbing a plastic keycard against a dead Velociraptor. And that's enough raptor slapping for now, let's get back into the real playthrough. So what we're going to do first is we're going to head into the options menu here and we're going to uh, see if we can increase the resolution of the game. Oh, whoa, hello, ha, yeah. So, 640 by 480 is fine. It's okay. We're just going to leave it, we're, we are going to leave it at that. Let's get out of here. Let's load a game. Uh, we're going to load our most recent game, whatever that is. I'm pretty sure it was right after the lab. Okay. Please work, please work, please wait, please, 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 please. okay. Yeah, you know what? This is fine. 640 by 480 is... This is fine. So like all other Trespasser levels, you lose all your weapons in the beginning, but it usually throws a little weapons stash uh, behind you. So you got a shotgun and whatever the hell this three thing is. Left. It's, only, it's only got three shots. That's not, the, it's not a lot. And I dropped it. Three shots. Okay, yes, we know. It's toxic. All right, let's move on. So uh, it's got a scope. You can uh, aim with the little red dot, I guess. Can you actually uh, can you actually sight down the scope in other games? That is usually handled with the right mouse button, ex except in this game where the right mouse button makes you drop your gun, and it um, will then get sucked into a hillside. It come on, please come on, no! Oh God, my God! So while I was occupied trying to pull this gun out of the world, uh, this Allosaurus got very interested in me, and now it's chasing me, and it is not giving up. It is not letting me go. So I'm actually going to be forced to use one of these darts. I've only got three, and I really kind of wanted to save them. I don't know how many it's going to take to take this thing down, so... Okay, so the answer is one. It takes one. So I'm being chased by an army of Velociraptors, I have no guns, and my prospects for life are fairly slim, unless I can find a weapon of some kind lying around, maybe behind this rock. Okay, good. Two dessert eagles. I'm safe. I'm safe. Just pick one up. Pick one up. Pick, 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 pick. pick. Not that, 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 that rib cage. Okay, so I swap out the rib cage for a sledgehammer, and honestly, my prospects for staying alive have not improved in the least. Uh, character is kind of rubbing it harmlessly against the Velociraptor's back, holding it sideways. Uh, so, yeah, you know, I, I'm, I'm very much dead. Is that rock 2D, or is it just my imagination? Is it? Yeah, it was just my imagination. It's fine. Oh my god, I'm so dead. Two raptors, and I've only got one gun left. Three, but three bullets. Two. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. What? Oh god, I'm so dead. I can smell the ocean. You can smell, you can smell the ocean. Why would you say that? Okay, a time feels to go. Feels full. Let, okay, look, that's kind of bullshit. How do you know what full feels like? Let's try this out. Okay, one shot. Boom. Drop it. Now she knows that it's not full. She knows that it's not full. Full clip. You are made of lies. Okay, so we got the ocean. Um, can you swim? Can you swim in the ocean? Okay, so it's looking like a solid no. Don't. Don't, don't, don't you, don't you dare. Stay. Do not take another step forward. You took another step. You took a step. You made me do it. You made me do it. Oh, what, now you want a piece of this? Huh? What are you going to do? You're giving me a look. You are giving me a, um... Uh, um. Okay, so I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to let you off the hook this one time. Just this one time, I'm going to let you... Oh, my God. That was really intense. Dinosaur Park. What a great idea. Why would you say that? Why? Oh, hey. Okay, got a raptor chasing me. Let's uh, take that down real quick. Man, she is super casual about the whole being chased by dinosaurs thing. Ooh, ominous. Indiana Jones and the Temple of Nothing Bad in Particular. Am I right? Oh my god! 
Okay, so there's a flaw in the temple security system. If you do not stand next to dangerous objects, they do not fall. It's a big oh, come on. That Seriously? This is the most ridiculous security system ever that also somehow entirely works. Oh, are you going to fall? Is that what you're going to do? Are you going to fall? Are you going to fall? You're not going to... You're not gonna fall. This thing isn't gonna fall. Oh my god, it's falling. So this ancient pyramid has some kind of a, a dotted line on the stairs. That is definitely a dotted line. What happens when we cross it? What happens when we... Oh, it's falling! It's falling! It is... I am shocked and surprised. And I'm... Um, I, I think that's supposed to fall. Yeah! Fall! Crush your enemies! Fall! And... Miss... Them... Missed... He had one job. That was a, that was a complete waste of time. One shot left. Just enough to blow my brains out, actually. I was supposed to use that thing at the top of the pyramid to kill the T-Rex that was waiting at the bottom. I should have seen that coming from like a mile away. And now T-Rex is not very happy with me. It's very aggressively chasing me up this mountain. And I can hear it kind of stomping around to my... It, um, it overshot me. The T-Rex overshot me. So fortunately, all I have to do is make this one little jump. But as we know, jumping a trespasser is a huge pain in the... Yeah, I can't believe I made that jump. That was... That was impossible. Yeah, screw you, T-Rex. Stupid dino. Okay, so the next level is right over this ridge. And as we all know, uh, when you enter a new level in Trespasser, there are guns behind you, cleverly hidden. You just have to um, find them. There are uh, no guns in this level. There are only rocks. But rocks are fine. I can make do with rocks. Watch this. Rocks are actually one of the most effective weapons in the game. Eat rock. Oh, I'm dead. gone. I love this game. You know what? I am actually going to have to, uh, I'm going to have to climb that mountain. That is what I'm going to have to do. Fortunately, there are some shotguns here. Some All I got to do is, uh, not the sawhorse! God damn it! This is actually one of the hardest jumps in the game. The problem is that the jump button doesn't always respond. Uh, sometimes you hit it and it works, and sometimes you hit it and it doesn't. So I was hitting it like a hundred times there and it didn't jump once. We are going to keep trying this jump until we've got it, because there's no other way around it. See, it just, it just doesn't work. It just doesn't work. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. See, it works there, it works there, it works there. It works there, come on, all right, one more. Oh, jump. As far as I can tell, this is accurate. So you might remember in previous Trespasser videos, I mentioned uh, that you can only carry two guns, but that doesn't stop you from uh, throwing guns further down the road, going back, picking up old ones, and sort of chaining them together so you've got multiple guns Tension. available at every... Oh, hello. Ooh. Well, that was easy. October 1996. The okay, so we're going to throw this over the ridge so that we can use it later. And, oh, no. No, 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 no. Stop. Stop rolling. Stop. Do not. Do not. Do not fall. Please. I need... It's... Yeah, it's gone. That is gone. We are never seeing that gun again. I'm gonna make it! This is the greatest thrill of my life! I'm king of the world! Woohoo! Woohoo! I... Ah! Ooh, oh, oh, God, no, get me, go! Oh, no! Oh, 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 oh. The debacle of August twenty. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. De debacle, debacle. Well known. I believe, I believe the word you're looking for, Mr. Edinburgh, is uh, debacle. Debacle is the word. Let's let's listen to it again. I probably misheard. The debacle. No, I did. I did not mishear. The word is actually debacle. 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 I've been saying debacle for like 47 minutes. Oh my god, okay, there's uh, uh, something new here. This is a new mechanic that I've seen. There seems to be some sort of uh, uh, elevator. Some buttons, we got some buttons to press. We got some, uh, got some buttons. If I, uh, do what the, ooh, okay. That turned something on, that turned, uh, that activated something. What is this, uh, what am I, whoa, whoa, hang on. What, what the hell? What am I? Oh, okay, that's dropping the elevator. Okay, I think I figured it out. I just need to hold this down, and as I do that, the elevator descends to uh, to ground level, and the other button makes the oh. elevator ascend. But since I need to hold it at the same time, I think what it's asking me to do is to shoot this onto the other button. Yep, we're fucked. 
Okay, yeah, so all I need to do is I need to rearrange these boxes into the exact position that they were in uh, before. This is not... Okay, you know what? This is fine. I can work with this. I just gotta pull this piece of plywood out of the out of the box. There we go. Very good. Now I just gotta rearrange it just the same way it was. Oh my god, this is gonna be... It's gonna take fucking forever. Okay, this is fine. You know what? I have all the functionality, all the tools I need to make this work. I just, I just gotta balance it. It's gonna fall. Oh my... Oh my god. Okay, so I got it. It took me like four hours, but I think... I think this might be good. Okay, so I'm just going to pick this up. Here we go. Please, please, please work. Please, please, please. Yes! Oh, my God. I can't believe that worked. I cannot believe that worked. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Wow. That was, uh, that was a really long time. That was a long time to make that work. But Oh, ooh, this uh, is... Okay, Whew, God. That was... I just had a little moment there. But, uh... You know what? You know what? This is the final level of the game. We did it. We did it. We just gotta hit this button and the world is our oyster. Let's do it. Um, hello? Hello? Anyone out there? I need help. This is a United States Navy priority channel. Identify yourself or clear the air. Hold your position, ma'am. We got people in the area. We're dispatching a helicopter to your current location. Thank you. I mean... Roger that. Over and out. Okay, so that's it. That's, uh, that is it, apparently. That's all you gotta do. You, you just gotta, just gotta listen to the nice man. Gotta hold your position. So that is what we're gonna do. We are going to hold our position. Holding our position. Holding our position. Hold. Okay, so yeah, you can't actually hold your position if you want to beat the game. You have to do the exact opposite of that. You have to not hold your position, and instead you gotta go up these I stairs. Mean, you gotta go up these platforms. You got to uh, basically continue your trek up the mountain uh, instead. And this is the final boss arena right here. This is it. This is uh, this is what it's all come down to. You fight two Velociraptors, two Velociraptors, and and an Allosaurus. That's the final boss of the game. You have to kill them all. That's it. That's one. There's the other Velociraptor right over there. That's it. Now we got the uh, we got the Allosaurus. We just got to make sure that uh, that we don't die. We don't die. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Pick it. Not the box. Not the box. Pick up the gun. Pick up the gun. Okay. Okay. Just stay. Just stay right there. Just stay right there. Stay perfectly still. Stay right there. That's good. That's good. Okay. Uh, we're he's uh he's stuck. He's stuck. That's good. That's fine. I'll th I, I, I can work with that. I can work with that. Let's, uh, let's find the gun. Got a gun. Okay. Oh, there he is. There he is. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Shoot. 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 That's it. Okay. That's, uh, that, that's, uh, that's Trespasser. That's Trespasser. That's, that's, that's the end. That's the end. It's not the end. There's actually a box puzzle. There's one more box puzzle to get out of, to get out of here. Uh, this is actually the final boss of the game. This is the final encounter of the game. Oh, my God. This, uh is worse than a T-Rex fight. Here we go. Oh, God. Okay. This is it. This is it. Jump. Jump. Okay. That's it. You know what? That's it. That's it. That's it. All we got to do is survive. We got to survive walking down these stairs. Got to survive walking down the stairs. You know what? John Hammond? John Hammond? I've had enough. I've had enough of John Hammond. There's the helicopter. Taking us away. Taking us away from Jurassic Park. Taking us away from Site B. Taking us away from John Hammond's weird ghost voice. Back to our apartment. This is a little final, uh, little final cinematic here. And it's Jill. This is like the ace message I'm leaving you. I'm sensing some sort of pattern here. Come on in, quit being Nancy social and pick up the phone sometime. Man, oh, Jill is saying, a complete dick. Calling me unless you have a damn good excuse. She turned into a raptor claw. That is as good of an excuse as any. So that is Trespasser Jurassic Park from start to finish. Now, I got to thank you for joining me on this weird little escapade. Like I said in the first episode, I absolutely love this game. A huge shout out to Seamus Blackley and Richard Wyckoff and everyone who worked on this game and poured the blood, sweat, and tears into making it happen. You know, you got to respect the, the level of, uh, of passion and pure talent that went into making this game. You know, the real-time physics engine, the the expansive open world environments, the weapon limits, the regenerating health, all these things, you know, they exist in games now, we take it for granted, but Trespasser was the first one to bring it all together in one game. So despite the game's many flaws, it's many, many, many flaws, that's why I still love it, and that's why it's uh, deserving of critique and praise. 
So next time we're going to take a look at another video game, one that innovated in many interesting ways, and divided critics and gamers alike. I'm talking about Alone in the Dark, 2008. Till next time, everyone.